what's up everybody Naresh here welcoming you back into another video and in today's video i have got my hands on this sony wireless speaker model number srs xb32 which is a new release by sony speaker collection if you have been following my channel previously i have owned a lot of bluetooth speaker most of them coming from the china well medium kind of range ones they work pretty good well this time i treated myself with this srs xb32 extra bass bluetooth speaker and i've got very high anticipations with it now as usual first we're going to have a look into the key feature of this sony wireless speaker following with the performance now within the performance i'll be also showing you how you're going to pair this speaker with your mobile phone and play some royalty free music obviously i don't want to get flagged with the youtube and by the end of this video you will have an idea that would you like to spend your hard-earned cash on this speaker or not so let's get into it now to start with here we have a couple of key features starting with the ip67 rating which is water and dust proof 24 hour battery life party booster and wirelessly connect up till 100 speakers together dual port usb support to charge this speaker salt water resistant so you can use it on c site live sound mode left and right speaker add function speaker phone and voice assist system with your mobile phone now in terms of all feature speaker seems to be very promising now let's see what we have in the packaging now package includes multiple user manuals one standard micro usb charging cable now in last but not least we have our sony srs xb32 wireless speaker which is to start with is nfc enabled so pairing process will be very easy on top of the speaker we have all multifunctional control buttons starting with the live play and a pause and a call attend button positive and negative to control the volume and power on and off in a pairing button where in the front of unit we have 248 mm speaker units this means powerful sound and a bass right in front of it and also come with the two passive radiator one in the front another one on the back also in the front of the speaker we have the led lights which show you the party experience you wanted to have and show off you can also change the color of this led as well as the functionality by using the app which is available in google play store and is called Fice stable app now on back of a speaker we have a compartment from where you can access usb output charging port battery indicator wps to connect other speaker and add them into it and a micro usb charging port along with the status indicator light right on the top of it and right next to it we have a factory restore button as well as the auxiliary input for non bluetooth supporting devices now whenever you're using this speaker outdoors in water areas make sure that compartment is shut completely in base of the speaker we have a sony logo and four studs to keep the speaker steady on a table or a floor when it's pounding big bass out of it now let's go ahead and power up this speaker first time and pair it with our mobile phone now within this process i would also show you how you can get the sony media center app which will help you to have a great experience with the sony srs xb32 bluetooth speaker on a press of a button you can just power this speaker up if you have a mobile phone with nfc enabled you can pair this speaker with it with no trouble whatsoever but if it's not let me show how you're gonna do that just press and hold this power on but a couple of seconds open up your mobile phone straight away go into the bluetooth settings and make sure it's in the discovery mode as well then down below in available devices you should be able to locate srs xp32 speaker click on it and press the pair button once it's paired you're going to hear the notification on the speaker itself as well you are ready to enjoy the music on this speaker but let me show you the app which you need to download on your mobile phone the app is available for android as well as for ios user i'm on an android mobile phone so i'm going to go into google play store and search for the app sony music center app there we go right in there click onto the install button while you're installing sony music center app you can also install fear stable fear stable app as well if i'm pronouncing it right guys which will help you to control the leds of your speaker 
Now, once you have both of these applications installed, open up the first one, which is Sony Media. Now, once app is open, now once app is open, you're going to see your SRS XP32 speaker in there. Open it up first time. Now, once the speaker is configured with your mobile phone, you're going to access it from here. Now, straight away go down into the settings of it, where you're going to see the option for the sound and the sound modes where you have a present mode which is set to extra bass and you have a multiple selections in here starting with the standard extra bass and a live sound you also have a manual setting of your bass treble and mids now within the same area you also have an option for the power illumination which is to do with these led lights how you want them There is a quite there you have a quite a lot of selection at this moment if it's selected on a strobe you can have a different action if you want to then you have other settings to do with the bluetooth kodak at the moment it's selected to auto i will keep it there next is the system and the party booster which is really a very nice feature and i'll show you how you become a dj using this sony bluetooth speaker now within this app you can also add some music services so you have a one media center let's suppose i like to play music from youtube so i'm going to play add app and select the youtube you can add as many apps which you have on your mobile phone for the music to enjoy right from the main media center now let's go ahead and step into the performance test where first we'll be playing some royalty free music from youtube Now working as activating the voice assistant of your mobile phone. Now press and hold three second display and pause button. Okay, Google, how's weather? Currently in Huddersfield, it's 13 degrees and mostly cloudy. The forecast tonight is 11 and partly cloudy. Now performance of speaker in party mode is fantastic. You can mix a song yourself if you want to. By just simply going into the media center app, scroll down to the speaker settings and go down into the party boost. Now within the party mode, you have multiple settings. Two of them are preset. Another one is a customizable. I'm going to select the drum setting first and show you how it performs. Look at this now. Oh yeah.
That is fantastic. <laughs> now for the performance in water. <laughs> The other good thing about this Bluetooth speaker is it floats, so don't worry about it if you got a big swimming pool. Now let's have a look into the pairing of multiple speakers of Sony together. To do this you need to use the Sony Media Center app which makes it much easier. Now the other speaker which I have to pair is this Sony SRS XB41. Open up Music Center app, go down into your SRS XB32 speaker and click on to group with other speakers and click wireless pair chain. In here, if your speaker is online, you're going to see that. Click on it and click connect. And once it's all done, click OK on it. Now here we have both of these speakers chained up. Let's play some music. <laughs> And the master one would be the one which is paired with your mobile phone and by controlling the volume on the master one you can also control on the slaves too now if you ask my recommendation about this bluetooth speaker i would highly recommend it even though it's got a couple of drawbacks like not having a usb-c type connection which is most of the devices nowadays we are getting it it's the latest bluetooth speaker sony should have done that one part the second part is that they should have introduced the Bluetooth 5.0 rather than still sticking with the 4.2. Other than that, fantastic Bluetooth speaker, great sound quality, bases are perfect and everything you wanted to expect from Sony is right in here. So on that note guys, thank you very much for watching this video. If you still have any more questions or reservation about this speaker, please let me know in the comment section below. I will be happy to answer any of your queries. And I also left a link in the video description for you if you would like to purchase this speaker. So guys, that will be all and see you in the next video soon. Bye.